Hi guys, my name is Alexa and welcome back to the Not Rose channel. Today's video is a haul for you. I will be showing you guys things that I've received from Cupshe, Fart Top, and Make Me Chic. So let's get on to the video. So the first brand I want to share with you guys is a women's online store called Cupshe. And right now they have a ton of cute bathing suits. They have a bunch of bikinis and one pieces. And one of my favorites that I picked up was this one piece. And it kind of resembles like a wetsuit that you would wear um, in the ocean. Where else would you wear it to? The print kind of has that classic Hawaiian, you know what I mean? The ones that you see on all of the tourist shirts. I just really love the mesh parts because it's totally something different. So that's this piece. I also picked out this pink bikini. It's a two-piece bikini. Can't really see it right now because of the light. Oh. It's sort of like a baby pink and it comes with these bottoms. I think the only thing with this is that the top part was just two inches too big. I mean, you I don't know if you guys could tell in the try-on video, but it was pretty big on me. Maybe because I don't have boobs or... But I mean, the set is a small. The bottoms fit perfectly because the set is so simple that it probably won't even go out of step. Next bathing suit from Cupshe is this white one piece. It's a white lace-up one piece. It looks really cute and has a ton of potential, but I think because the sizing is one size that it was really big on the waist area and then just really big in the boobage area so it was quite large on me but for the most part it looks cute so maybe I'll be able to alter it to make it fit my body type maybe I'll shoot another picture like an updated one afterwards I picked up this bodysuit it's a plunging v-neck bodysuit and actually, you know, wearing it and if you don't bend over and you keep your body upright, it looks amazing and it stays. However, when you bend over, these things flop open and stuff like that. So unless you wear this like underneath, this I think might be actually pretty cute like under a white top like this, a fitted white top. That way you can wear it and not have to worry about your boobs falling out or I mean, Unless these bodysuits are like made for women with like really big boobs and it just somehow just stays flat. I'm not sure. And I also picked out a dress and I want to say, I don't know if I'm colorblind, but this thing keeps changing colors. So it's a ruched mini dress. It looks sage green, but at the same time it kind of looks just gray. Like right now it looks gray. Inside it looks sage green. I like this cute ruching and it has like a nice um, overlay on the skirt that goes diagonal. Um, again, I think this dress was probably made for big breasted women because the blueberry was just too big and <laughs> yeah, and you just really don't. The last thing that I picked up from Cupshe is this pink and blue leaf print bikini and comes with matching bottoms. So I really like this set, um, not only because I really dig the print, I thought the print was absolutely cute. Actually, that's probably why I picked the bathing suit because I really like the print on it. It was adorable. And um, we're going to Hawaii in May, so it's gonna be perfect for when we go. And I will definitely take pictures in this bikini on the really pretty beaches. So yeah, this is probably one of my favorites out of this batch. So the next brand that I'm gonna talk about is Park Top, and they sent me this velvet jacket, this velvet bomber jacket, which is absolutely adorable. It has little embroidered patches on it, like down the sleeve, and it has it like all over the front. It's floral, and this cute little tiger guy, actually two little tiger guys. But this jacket is not a warm jacket. I want to just say that right off the bat because it is just one layer of velvet. But it is cute like if it's kind of chilly and you want to just throw a jacket over, this jacket would be perfect. I actually don't have anything burgundy or maroon really in my closet as outerwear. So this is a perfect addition to the closet. So I'm pretty much a small in all of my clothes, but I did order a large because, I don't know, I just like my jackets to be oversized and just like kind of like, I just like to be swimming in my in my jackets. I don't know if it's because like I like to feel like I'm 
also wearing a blanket. If you guys are a small and like how large looks on me, then I definitely suggest getting that. So speaking of bomber jackets, next up I have this bomber jacket that I have been eyeing forever on Pretty Little Thing. So this jacket is has like this snake skin material, but it's in pink. That's what makes it even more better, I want to say. But yeah, um, I got this in an eight, so it's already already oversized to begin with. An eight, I think, and Pretty Little Thing is like a small. So it's oversized and I absolutely love it. Another thing that I got from Pretty Little Thing is this necklace. It's a choker. It's a rhinestone cross pendant choker. And I believe it's in the Pretty Little Thing um, Sophia Richie collection unless only the gold one is and the silver one isn't. I have only worn it a few times only because it's pretty flashy and it's very out there but I just loved it because of the pendant and it's just all the rhinestone stuff that goes along. I actually got a couple more things from Pretty Little Thing but I didn't want to add them into the haul. So the last brand that I'm going to talk about is Make Me Chic. I just have a ton of stuff for Make Me Chic so I actually just pulled out a few things that I bought recently. Ooh, my hair. So the first thing that I'm going to show you guys is this faux leather buckle overall dress and for some reason I really dig overalls and I dig faux leather. So I had I saw this and I just had to get it. And I really like that it gives off a kind of a 90s vibe. Yeah, so the only thing is that it's a little bit long again because I'm short and it looked a lot better on the model because she's a lot taller than me. They also have a ton of shoes which I always buy my shoes from there because they just have such a collection. So I'm going to be basic for a second. Not like I'm not always basic but most of the time I am. And I went and bought the clear transparent booties. Yuck. So the last time I wore these was during New Year's and I'm just like looking at them and they're disgusting. Look at them. Ugh. Stuff everywhere. But yeah, I felt like I needed booties or some type of shoe that I could wear with anything casual or going out. And this was pretty much perfect because obviously transparent, you can't go wrong with clear boots. You know what I mean? Next up are these mules. Uh, that I wear pretty much all the time. I love mules, especially, I think this is like three inches. These are basically my slippers when I don't want to be lame and wear my freaking fuzzy slippers and I want to actually wear slippers, but with a little bit of class, I will go to these. I've broken them in already, so ooh. So they're pretty comfortable. I definitely suggest getting these, especially if you're into mules. So the last shoe is this kind of crazy, Heel thing boot? I don't even know. It's not boot. It's, a, it's more of like heel. I'm trying to show you guys with my arm. They are a little bit hard to walk in because you hardly have like any support here. Look at this. But they actually look really cool. I don't know what's more to say. If you're into minimal shoes, minimal kind of extreme shoes, I definitely suggest these. They're good for like an hour, two hour, three hour max event and then you're gonna need some slippers after that. So that is all that I have for you guys for this haul today. If you did enjoy it, which I hope you guys did, please give it a thumbs up. I will put all the links down in the description box below. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Blog11, and if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, don't forget to do so down below. And I believe that's it, yeah. Um, I will be back. Uh, we'll probably do like hauls every month because we are girls and we go shopping a lot and I do want to share with you guys what we buy. That is it and I will see you guys in our next video. Bye! Oh my gosh, I just realized my choker was like backwards this whole time.